السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو مائی چینل ایم آصف میتھ کارنر ٹوڈے وی ول لرن اباؤٹ دی انڈیکس آف سب گروپس ان گروپ جی واٹ از انڈیکس انڈیکس لیٹس ٹاک فرسٹ وی ٹیک دی ڈیفینیشن آف انڈیکس دی نمبر آف ڈسٹنکٹ لیفٹ کو سیٹ ڈسٹنکٹ ورڈ مین that uh, there is no repetition which are which have different elements left or right cosets of subgroup h of g called the index of h in g that will call the index of subgroup in group g and that is denoted by this h and ratio g ratio h which mean that index of h in g we read it index of h in g so let's see by an example find the distinct left quotient and right quotient of subgroup we have a group integer is sexual addition the group g integer is plus 0 plus minus 1 plus minus 2 plus minus 3 up to so on this is the group of g integer and we take its subgroup that all even elements 0 plus minus 2 plus minus 4 plus minus. now first we get the left cosets or right cosets then the number of left or right distinct left or right cosets will be the index of h in g in cosets we take the number any uh, and all the elements one by one first element from g and it's because it's with respect to addition so we add for example first element of g is 0 we add 0 in e then we add 0 in 0 it give us 0 we add 0 in 2 plus minus 2 it give us plus minus 2 then we add 0 in plus minus 4 here we are adding so it give us the e subgroup itself by adding identity element we know that by adding a zero is additive identity and by adding identity there will be no change in the element so let's take the second element of g second element of g is plus minus 1 we adding plus 1 in all the elements of this subgroup e when we add 1 in 0 we get 1 plus minus 1 when we add plus minus 1 in plus minus 2 we get plus minus 3 then we add plus minus 4 uh, 1 in plus minus 4 we get plus minus 5 you can see that this set this and this are unique this distinct distinct word means that these are distinct no element is common in this and this there is no element common so this is also make the partition of g as well this distinctness give us a message that when we take the union of e and 1 plus e it give us z it which make complete z it mean that e and 1 plus e is partition of z and e and 1 plus e are the distinct left cosets and these are 1 and 2 it mean that z with respect to uh, it mean that h which is e here as left 
two left cosets in G. Only two left cosets in G. There is no other left coset. It means that its index index is two. If we find three left cosets, then index will be three. If we find one left left coset, the one right coset or left or right uh, in the groups in which are abelian, their left and right cosets are same. But when we go in matrices, their left and right coset may not be same. So let's come next. When we take union, here we see the distinctness of left and right coset. When we take the union of E and 1 plus C, it gives us complete V. This means it is partition of V. And when we take the intersection of E and 1 plus E, it gives us phi empty set. This is distinctness. Distinctness. Okay. Distinctness means all the left cosets have no common element. So we find the two left cosets, 1 and 1 plus E. That's why the index of V, index of E in V is. Similarly, you can find other indexes, indexes of other groups and subgroups. Hope you understood. And if you like my videos, please share it because your share has value for that person who needs it, who want to learn it. Thank you so much.